and elite special forces operative for the new Wutai government. I have orders to infiltrate Shinra headquarters and steal their ultimate materia. To prove to our common enemy that Wutai is not to be trifled with! Members of Avalanche! With your full support! We got this! Members of Avalanche? Where are you? Come get me already! Uh, okay, if I was a man in a Moogle hat. Huh? Wait, does this mean what I think it does? Interesting. So, I gotta come to you, do I? You got some nerve.
Okay? Anybody home? Midgar was supposed to be the marvel of the modern world. Talk about false advertising. City of Mako? <laughs> City of garbage more like. You'll 
gone. Must have gotten used to it. <laughs> way things are going, I'll be working for Shinra next. Nice try, Midgar. Ugh, I'm talking to myself. City's getting me. Any monster troubles or... Monsters have been acting strange. It's not gonna be good for any of us if yeah. Wutai's got their claws in this. Mogul Reactor 5 has been temporarily shut down and all fires have been successfully extinguished. The situation is under control and the people about their city need not worry about any additional complications. We are in the process of conducting a full forensic investigation but we suspect the device used was similar to that employed in the attack on Mako Reactor 1. Oh, 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 what do we have here? <laughs> Man, that's gotta be Avalanche! Not bad, not bad at all, but I can do better. 
Yuffie? <laughs> Yo. What? There's our palm. So, you're Avalanche? I'm Jija. Follow me. What? Wait up! So, Jijie, why didn't you come meet me before? I figured an elite W agent could find their own way. I may be elite, but it's not like I've ever been to Midgar. And what exactly is a W, anyway? Anyone who lives where you just came from, think of it as a code name. Uh-huh. Still can't believe they sent a kid to do this job. This kid could kick your ass! Saying you're a fresh face is all. Oh, don't worry. I know exactly what you're saying. Give me a break, will ya? And let you walk all over me? Well, here we are. Ladies first. These two are Billy Bob and Polk. And that's Nayo. Hi. My name is Yuki, Materia Hunter and Elite Special Forces Operative for the new Utai government. I have orders to infiltrate Shinra HQ and steal their ultimate materia. To prove to our common enemy that Utai is not to be trifled with! Members of Avalanche, with your full support, we got this! Ready to rumble, huh? You better believe it! So, did you guys meet Sonan yet? He was supposed to be here. Yeah, he got in three days ago. He's out on the town as we speak. <laughs> really seems to be enjoying it here. Oh, he does, does he? You, uh, got any bags? As if. Ninjas always travel light. It's like a rule. Huh. <sighs> but I did bring these. Wu Tai's famous da chow beans. Eat up. And here you go. Uh, huh. hmm. oh. 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 <clears throat> Can you eat these things? <laughs> Guess you do. Sheesh, you ninjas are insane. <laughs> Do me a favor, Yuffie, and wait here for Sonon. I gotta head out. Your ID should be ready for pickup by now. Then why don't I join ya? Nah, I got this. Besides, you reek of trouble. <laughs> huh? tired from your trip. Why don't you get some rest? With all the noise in this city? I'm freaking possible. How about you tell me where in the Shimmer building they're keeping that materia instead? Don't hold out on me now. I know you know. Actually, I kind of don't. At least, not an exact location. All I know is that Shinra, for most purposes, treats materia as a weapon. Which means the Advanced Weaponry Division probably deals with it. And since that's in the basement, I see. So, Shinra hides its top secret materia in the basement. <laughs> you won't have to wait much longer, my precious. I promise. Just be careful, will you? Please? Oh, yeah. You should introduce yourself to Billy Bob. 
He knows a thing or two about the Shinra building. <sighs> My teeth! You're welcome. So the materia I'm looking for is in the Shinra building, right? And where is that exactly? <laughs> Ignorance truly is bliss, huh? What did you just say? Oh, <laughs> didn't mean to offend you. Of course, you probably knew this already, but there's a whole other city built on the plate above us. Shinra Building's right in the middle. You can't miss it. Oh, that one. Why didn't you say so? Now, if you want to get topside, you first got to get out of the slums. And for help with that, you should talk to Polk. You look kind of nervous. I just want to make sure I have the plan down pat. You know, like how to get up top and all that. <sighs> well, if you had an ID, you'd normally just take the train up there. But with all the commotion going on, that's not really an option. Security's on high alert. If you ask me, your best bet is to sit tight and wait for things to settle down some. Sit tight? But I want to go now! Be my guest then. Go get killed. Harsh. Someone's still not back? We must be in Wall Market then. What's Wall Market? Let's just say it's a place for people with mature tastes. Mature tastes. There's lots of different establishments. It's kinda hard to explain. No, I think I get it. Like bars filled with smoke so thick you can't even see. And drinks so bitter, you wanna spit them right back out. Uh, where everyone gets drunk and complains about how kids just don't understand the value of hard work. They'll be the death of society. Ugh, how can they not see that they're the ones destroying it? <laughs> Wutai's got a place like that, where grown-ups drink their lives away. It's called the Happy Turtle. Interesting. There's a Happy Turtle in Midgar as well. Huh? I don't know where exactly, because I've never actually been, but I do see their flyers from time to time. You do, huh? Oh, they're taking down Midgar one citizen at a time! <laughs> I salute you, Happy Turtle. Come to think of it, there's a man who goes around putting up flyers for the bar. People call him Old Snapper, and he doesn't dress like your average Midgar male. Might be from Wutai. I gotta find him. Man deserves some de chow beans. Hey, you gonna be okay out there? Got all the info you need? You know about the VR combat simulation module, right? Huh? Uh, of course I do. Why wouldn't I? It's that thing that stimulates modulation. Hmm? <laughs> Kinda. It's a machine that puts you in a virtual world where you can practice fighting all you want. There's even a portable version of it. Guy around the corner has one. Uh-huh. Hardly ever see technology that cutting edge down here. So what do you say? Want to try it? I really don't have time to be playing around with some stimulator. But, just to be polite, I guess I'll take it for a spin. <laughs> the guy's name is Chadley. He's over by the neighborhood watch. If you ever feel like some virtual training, I'm sure he'd be happy to help. You look about ready to die of boredom. Wanna play Fort Condor? Fort... Condor? <laughs> I should've known. It hasn't been out long, so there's no way you W's would have heard of it. Uh, yes I have. And what's more, I'm awesome at it. I'll whoop you so hard you'll wonder if you ever knew the rules. For my benefit, then. Let me go over them.
how'd you do that? You totally kicked my ass. You mean you didn't lose on purpose? Wow. <laughs> well, if you're looking for a challenge, the Undercity's got no shortage of serious players. I've kind of got better things to do. Sure about that? Where it is, if you beat the Grandmaster, you can win some serious cash. Materia, too. Materia? That's right. But you should know, the hardcore competitors won't give you the time of day till you've proven yourself. Whatever. Bring it on! Ugh. All this talking's giving me a headache. I'm gonna go do some recon. <laughs> I won't stop you. Just don't go too far, okay? Hey, you up for a round of Fort Condor? Oh, you sure? Man, just my luck. Duncan was sold out everywhere. Searching for candidates. Candidate detected. Performing physical analysis. She seems relatively agile and has substantial muscle mass for her stature. Hmm. An acceptable candidate. Hey, uh, you want to tell me what you're mumbling about? My apologies. My name is Chadley. Would you be interested in helping me with my research? I'm Yuffie. Nice to meet you. So, what are you researching? Combat. It would entail doing battle with a summon in a virtual arena using this portable simulator. Interested? Sure, why not? I'm a kick its butt. Very well then. What a shame, it was a close match. However, I did manage to obtain some invaluable data. Analyze and learn from your mistakes so that you can claim victory next time. Can I assume you're ready to do battle with a virtual summon?
What a shame. It was a close match. Analyze and learn from your mistakes so that you can claim victory next time. Can't keep canceled. This here's the mm. history. This will be done before the day. You ever heard of that? Hey, uh, Oh, the giant here that away at the happy turtle. Ho oh, ho, greetings, Softshell. So, how many of those flyers did you find? What? Ahem. Collect just six flyers for the happy turtle, and a one of a kind prize could be yours. Ring any bells? Nope. Well, then, allow me to explain. The happy turtle's running a contest. And the rules are simple. All you have to do is collect six of our fabulous flyers from around Sector 7, and you'll earn yourself a prize sure to delight even the dourest Diamondback. <laughs> Sadly, a handful of locals have taken to acting like stink pots toward anything Mutayan, especially since the bombing. Some have even gone so far as to tear down my poor posters. Little wonder nobody's won yet. Bummer. <sighs> Which leaves me in a pretty predicament. But hey, my pain might be your game. By collecting just a handful of flyers, you could be the first, and at this rate, the only winner of the most testudinarious contest in Midgar's history. This here is a sample of one of our ads. Breathtaking, isn't it? Now it's up to you to find all six. Leave no shell unturned, no pond unplumbed. That prize is as good as mine. Ah, since you're here, you wouldn't happen to have any Condor coins on you, would you? This job may keep a shell over my head, but my real passion's coin collecting. I'd gladly part with some oddities and commodities in exchange for those little buttes. Sonon's gotta be back by now. Huh, I know that tune anywhere. Kid, but do you mind? I'm not exactly in the mood. Not that I'm surprised after what went down yesterday. How many is Well, now that's quite the get up you're sporting there. Dressed like a five-year-old. That's just weird. Uh, what are you talking about? This isn't weird. It's super cute. Super cute? <laughs> More like super lame. Not as lame as Midgar. Huh? Just saying how much I was looking forward to playing Fort Condor. I could really use the training, you know. Sure, I'll put you through your paces. But you do know it's gonna cost you, right? One match, three gil. Pay up.
Um, excuse me? I cheated and I still lost? <laughs> what can I say? Talent trumps all. <laughs> Whatever. You still owe me for my time. It's gotta be worth seven gil at least. As if. Avalanche or a bunch of ladies or grounders like us. How many hours? So much heavens, my happy place. Shinra's not just going to stand by and. So when your opponent leads with this, you respond with this? <sighs> this game is insane. Hey there, suit. How's that conversation with yourself working out? Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to disturb anyone. My daughter's been dying to play this game, and I promised to teach her. But first, I have to teach myself. That game wouldn't happen to be Fort Condor, would it? If you want, I'll help you figure stuff out. You, you will? Oh, thanks. That'd be a great help.
Well, what do you know? I think I'm starting to get the hang of this. Starting to get the hang of what? Losing? Losing on purpose, to be precise. If I can let my daughter win without her suspecting, that to me is as good as a victory. Boo! <laughs> I know, I know. But if it'll make her happy... It's probably the trains, keeping the town on top soon. Should we even be shopping at a time like this? Of course we should. We can't let them keep us from living our lives. scare me like that. I'm highly strung. You're trying to kill me? Or... Who? Who the hell are you? Who am I? Someone who doesn't spend all day muttering to themselves in the shadows. Like some kind of Shinra spy. Say what? Me? No. -uh. I was just, you know, thinking about stuff. Huh? Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, like how to bag that sweet, sweet Fort Condor prize money. It's my ticket out of here. <laughs> so you're after the Grandmaster too? Sorry to burst your bubble, Mr. Shadow Lurker, but I'll be the one taking home those spoils of war. What? Well, over my dead body, you will? My life's on the line here. I deserve to eat. I deserve to live. Just sometimes a guy's gotta do what a guy's gotta do.
can't be saying it ain't so. Oh, goodbye, fortune. Goodbye, pride. <laughs> now I'm taking down Midgar a citizen at a time. Hmm? Wait, what'd you say? That all of Midgar's gonna suffer the same fate. 